People ask me all the time about my passion for college football and why I bring it to television the way I do. And in thinking about it, the only reason, way I can truly articulate it was to write it. So I wrote a letter. I want to read it to you. Dear College Football, you offer a unique brand of kinship, fellowship, found nowhere else, and I mean nowhere. Your traditions on these crisp fall Saturdays unify us, even in moments of division. We are foes between your lines, but oddly your lines tend to erase those drawn between us and around us in our daily lives, and you create lasting memories. For me in recent years, those memories live in little towns all across this nation with huge identities, identities built upon your foundation. Places named Tuscaloosa and Baton Rouge, Columbus and Clemson. But the sweetest of those memories for me live right here in this little town, Blacksburg, Virginia. And in fact, in those very seats up here to my right. Those are the seats peering down from the ridge, down upon my childhood dreams. Those are the seats I shared with my daddy, felt his calloused hand upon my knee, saw him smile. I felt important to him here, had his attention, felt his love and hope he felt mine. Around here people know this, but when my daddy died 10 years ago, I lost a little piece of myself. And the only place I can find it is right here in Lane Stadium. So tonight, as that pregame clock eases towards the five minute mark, and Johnny Cash introduces Inner Sandman, and 66,000 people start jumping like wild people, and the electricity in the air here reaches a fever pitch, I will smile. And I'll probably weep a little bit too. A lot of you can relate. You've told me so in those little towns all over this nation, because for a lot of you, just like for me, fall Saturdays are so much more than just game day. Thank you, college football.